Welcome to Painting with Vanilla Biscotti. I am your host, Vanilla Biscotti. And today, we have a very, very special drawing. But first, a word from our sponsor. Painting with Vanilla Biscotti. We'll be right back. I bought the fresh stick, just as you told me. You're absolutely right. It's neat and quick, and it goes on dry. It did make me feel cool and sweet, just as you said. I did everything you said, but my boss still hasn't asked me to lunch. Unlike some deodorants, Fresh doesn't guarantee you'll get ahead in business. All Fresh does is keep you fresh. When you think of it, that's quite a lot. Hello, welcome back. As I said, we have a very, very special drawing today. So, without further ado and waiting, let's just get right into it, shall we? Now, you're not going to know who this is right away, and that's fine. But eventually, when we get down to the brass tacks, you're going to see that this fella is very, very familiar to you. And to me. You might have a guess who it is already from the socks and the shoes but it might not be anyone you think of so let's just continue drawing here let's see i don't want to tell you guys who it is yet until we're pretty close to being done okay and then this one will be this one's waving even though this character is not not very friendly but it's our creation it's our world we're gonna make him friendly this time. And it looks like it's time for me to cut away for another commercial break. Stay tuned. We will be right back after these messages. Now class, Mr. Tiger will show us how Kellogg's Sugar Frosted Flake cereal starts out. This a flake field? It's a cornfield. Kellogg's toast corn to golden flakes and adds a secret frosting. Helps keep them extra crunchy and delicious. It's part of your good breakfast and tastes. I know. Okay, and we're back. Now, gotta draw the eyes here. This character has very weird eyes. Kind of like, well, once you, once you see who I'm drawing, it will all make sense in the long run. Okay, now, and then we have a little bit of like that. Now, you might not know who this is yet, but when I start coloring, you'll definitely see. But first, we have to clean up some of my lines here, put things in the back that are supposed to be in the back, as you would with any any other kind of drawing, like that, and then we'll uh, get rid of these. These are behind the hand here, and then this one is behind that. So now we can start. Let me just make a little adjustment here. Now we can start coloring this friend so you can see who it actually is. Coloring, we'll just have to wait. We'll be right back. Two germs were killing a little time. And one of them said, let's go contaminate a house. Yeah, I know a place that's for me poisonally. So they rounded up the gang, millions of them, and bang, into kitchen, bathroom, floors, doorknobs, walls, woodwork, rails, pails, baby's room, everywhere. Until, until, until those germs found out Lysol, the concentrated germ killer, was on the job. Lysol, relentless enemy of germs. To use Lysol, measure two and one half tablespoons in a gallon of cleaning water, and death to evil germs. In the bathroom, on floors, walls, woodwork, in the sick room. Women, help protect your home against dangerous germs with Lysol. Keep Lysol on the job every day. 
Lysol brand disinfectant, America's largest selling disinfectant. Ask for Lysol at your druggist today. So let's, we're going to start with some red here and just start coloring this guy in. Now, what I do is I do it sloppy at first and then I go back and I make changes as I need to. I think right here we can kind of just clean this up here. Now every artist is different. You don't have to do it necessarily the way that I do it. We've all have certain ways to do things. If you have a different way to do, do a certain thing, by all means, you can do it your way. All right. I got our friend mostly colored in here. And then uh, we'll just, uh, sorry, it's been a while for me. So I'm still kind of relearning everything again. That's okay. It's a learning process. All right, then we color in up here. And we color in his eyes, which are right here. Color in his gloves. I'm gonna move these down to the bottom here. Oh, well, maybe right here is fine. Color in his socks here. And we color in his shoes, which will be this color. Now all those are colored in. Now we start adding character defining features. So like this. And then uh, he has a crest and we'll just make this that color. Now, here comes the fun part. Now we add, oops, we add shadows. And the easiest way to do shadows for me is to turn this down to like maybe 20 or so, pick black, and just color in anywhere you think a shadow would go. So right here, something like that and then this would come out like that like this and then like that the shoes down here a little bit on the ear here and you can even add a little bit to the shoes if you go down here just add a little bit to the shoes Okay, now, now we draw the background. So what I do is I start a new layer, pick a random color, and I just fill the canvas. Just fill the canvas. Just fill it all in, fill it all in. And then we move this layer all the way to the bottom. 
See, there's our friend. Now we pick another color, add another layer so they don't blend. Just make a crazy design. Now we have that, we have one more step. What I like to do is I merge all of these down like this. So then all these layers are one layer. Okay. And then I take this and I duplicate it. Now we take the bottom one here and we transform it. Just kind of move it just, just like this. That's fine. Now we hide that one, start a new layer, pick black, and we just trace over this. Doesn't have to be perfect. Just trace, 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 trace. Something like this. Get his hands, get his feet, get his legs. And then we bring this guy back. We turn this off and bring this down to about uh, 20 or 30. Now, when we bring this these layers back he has a nice drop shadow and he's perfectly shaded every time and just like that we drew a perfect shadow the hedgehog boy i hope you enjoyed this episode i can't wait to see you again take care have a good day have a good week and i will see you soon my friends